Welcome to Tiny Bites. Here's your host, citizen scientist in neurology, neuroplasticity, and positive psychology, Sandy Weaver. Want to become a great leader? And what does being a great leader mean to you? If you lead a team or want to lead a team, you owe it to the people you lead to be the kind of leader they need. What the heck does that mean? The Gallup team condensed the capabilities of a great leader into four key attributes. Trust, compassion, stability, and hope. People need someone they feel trusts them and whom they can trust. A sense of mutual respect and caring, the knowledge that the leader walks their talk, and someone who can instill a vision for the future, plus show them the path to get there. How can you become a great leader? Use your brain's executive function to improve your skills, knowledge, and mental well-being. Your executive function is your ability to observe your own thoughts and decide if they are thoughts that will help you grow or keep you stuck. Here's the key. You are the only person who can do this for yourself because you are the only person who can observe your own thoughts. Ready to be a great leader? Let your executive function lead the way. Subscribe to the podcast and share it with your friends. And there's lots more at centerforworkplacehappiness.com. Here's to your well-being, one tiny bite at a time.